Hi YouTube, this is the brand new Lego City um, j um, seaplane, as you can see there, seaplane, that luckily, in like pretty much a miracle, I found this at a Toys R Us for $14.99. Now this is a very cool set and it's definitely worth its money. It's very pretty big, like that says my hand, I have a pretty big hand. Uh, anyways, it's very good. It's got some stickers on the top and stickers on the wing, the same as the uh, old Lego City Airport. It also comes with a little minifigure, one minifigure. Now this minifigure has the normal red baseball cap with sunglasses and the smiley face, the silver sunglasses. He's got one of the plaid shirts, uh, one of the plaid shirts with uh, buttons, a little undershirt you can kind of see, and uh, it's got one of those checkered, red checkered shirts on him. Um, he's got just plain blue pants. He doesn't have a printed back. Um, this is pretty cool. This is a uh, little wind gauge. Um, this has a little gas canister, and it's one of those little wind things where it goes around and tells you how fast the wind's going. In what direction? Anyways, onto the plane. Now the plane, you can just pop off the roof. Little seat with the little. There's no seat, but there's just a little part for man to sit. Uh, little controls. Now there is. This is a really cool feature. Um, that I find like I was doing this a lot now. But hold on one second. The door on the back actually opens up, and it also does this on the other side. So as you can see, you can see right through. And you can only fit one briefcase, but it's little doors that close. And yeah, you get a briefcase, but a black one. I have a brown one. So I'd rate this set 9 out of 10, maybe 9.5. It's a very good set, you know definitely worth its money pretty big too you know like I have the cargo truck so it's about as big as the cargo truck kind of not that big but it's alright it's pretty good so next now we have another lucky find that I found at the Toys R Us which is hold on one second there This is the Lego City, also a brand new set. This is the Lego City smart car, which I'm guessing it is. And it comes with a new man. Uh, it has the same Matt Williams hair. Uh, he's got kind of a, kind of a, he doesn't have one of the normal faces. His grin's kind of more angled to the left. Um, he has, uh, I'm sorry you guys can't really see this, but he's got, a very nice printed torso sweatshirt, little pockets where he can put his hands into, but he actually can't because it's just printed. Uh, he's kind of got a little pattern going on around the bottom, and he's got the two straps that you can pull up, as you can kind of see there. A little trying to put. So yeah, the straps right there, and then he's got his a little green undershirt with also a little pattern. And the thing that I like also is it has a printed torso. So there's a little hood on the background that's printed on there. And on to the actual car. Now this set was $6.99. And by the way, these are all in Canadian dollars. $6.99. So it doesn't have brake lights at the bottom, but it has brake lights up at the top. Uh, it has opening doors that open on both sides. He's not here. Anyways, yeah, so it's, sorry, that was my mom. So it's got uh, opening doors on the sides. Uh, pretty cool grill. If you have, have ever seen the uh, Aston Martin Smart Car, that they've only made a couple of them, this is what it looks a lot like. But I like how it has the black. Now, it's kind of hard to fit a man in here. Kind of hard because of the little red piece that goes on the back of the tail light. But it's kind of hard to fit him in there, but that's okay. It's not bad. I'd rate this set, value of its money, nine because it's a little if it was 5.99 it would be a little bit better but 
Six ninety nine, I guess, is okay. And you can pop the little briefcase in the back also as well. Now, I bought two of these, and the Toys R Us, if you're wondering where it was, it was the Toys R Us in Belleville, Ontario, on the uh, other side of Lake Ontario. We were just coming back because I went with my dad to work on a uh, Monday. So, yeah, I rate these are both very great sets. I also saw the seaplane, and also all the other, and also the toys, or the, uh, sorry, the Toy Story sets as well. I saw all those there. The only sets that they didn't have in city was the gasoline truck and the electric truck, the cherry picker truck. They didn't have the airport or anything out yet, but they had all the fire equipment and everything, and they had all the Lego Toy Story merchandise there. They also had some new creator sets that I thought were very cool as well. There was a house and a plane. Thank you for watching, and uh, check out my new channel. Thank you. Bye.